All right, well, let's do more of this. I've been very hooked on it. Let me see. I tried the black deck, but I didn't really do well with it. So I'm just gonna go red, I think. Let's get started. Uh, da, da, let's do this. Nice. That was easy. Okay, uh, level up through a kind enhances two cards into multiplayer cards. One consumable slot. Let's get some multiplayer cards. Let's go with enhancing face cards. We could do something cool with face cards. But, um, do this. Yeah, this is a good one. Every card gains chips when scored. Um, I'm gonna save some money, initially. This card's two random cards. Okay, that aren't played. Got it. Okay, we got a king multiplier, so let's just go here. I'm gonna do this. Discard. Okay, nice. Um, do two pair. You know, just let me know when your island's open, Vanna, and I'll just drop the flowers off in the background. I can multitask. <laughs> this is a game that allows multitasking. Getting this. It's open? Okay. Do it now. This, this is built for pairs. So if I do this, let's just see what happens. Mm. 
Okay, it does decently. I think we can do something with this. Three of a kind and pairs are the way to go with this. Reach through to the first card. Plus 50 chips if the hand contains a pair. Alright, let's get both of these. Doing it. I got three of a kind, but you know, let's just do this first. Very, dude, a pair just won me that. Just 1800 off a pair. That's kind of crazy. do here. I have a pair, but I think when it's not used in scoring, it's gonna suck. I guess I kind of have no choice but to discard the junk I don't want. Okay, there we go. That, that's better. Good. I didn't think I could get a build with Pez uh, doing well. Thank you. Thank you as well. Helps a lot. That one's a cheap one. Just get the extra multiplier. Raise the interest. Definitely. Definitely want more interest and. Is just too. You know what? Let's just see. Aces give multiplier two times when card is discarded. If the first hand only has one card, no. Nah. Plus one to hand size. are enhanced. How's this build going so well? Retrigger all face cards. Doing that. The music kind of sounds risk of rainish. A little bit, yeah. I can see it. I like the loop. It, um, 
It doesn't sound repetitive. Making a stone card. I want a stone card. Oh shit, base card in a pair. Dude. These face cards are going to be worth a lot of chips. Because it's re-triggering the face card multiple times. Mental. This is a crazy build. It's already just working off pairs. If I got that, if I got that thing that says um, the multiplier happens every time you play the hand, it's going to be insane. That's a stone card. No, thank you. Arrow cards. I'll go a celestial pack. I might be able to level up. Okay. Plus two to flush straight full house. I mean, I may as well just. You know, it doesn't matter. There's no harm in leveling that out. Great, two random tarot cards. This will give me a refund. Doubles money. I could get my money back. I'll get my money back. Nice and easy. One negative one to hand size. Okay, that should be fine. That's my build has one extra hand size anyway. This is gonna be good. Look at that. That's so disgusting. The way this is working, just up, just pairs. Fifteen when zero discards remaining. Um, I'm going to go with this one. This, I love this this one. It's good. I card pair. There we go. Level up pair. Excellent. Keep this up forever. Oh, 
but it'll car it'll carry me for a little bit. I need that one that goes with um it'll upgrade based on the number of times that I've played it. It's the last tarot or planet card used during this run. Which was Mercury, so that leveled up a pair. Now pair is is going up again. Excellent. Alright, cool. So here I am purposely getting rid of cards. Doing discard so then the multiplier is better. Insanity. On, on purpose. Now watch this. Oh, six thousand. Oh my god, it worked. It just became a multiplier now. Let's go. Multiplier for every tarot card used. Um... This... Believe it or not, now this is better. Because it'll average out, then I don't, it'll just happen constantly. Um, we want to convert into a steel card, so what we're going to do, we're going to con. Oh, wait, but it's going to debuff it. Um, let's use Honor King. This will still be fine because it's a pair. It still scored 4,000 despite it being debuffed. Now I just gotta keep buying tarot cards. Eventually, this will be better than what I had before. Uh, let's get rid of this all around. Okay, uh, it's a, a pair is still a pair. They'll still get me a, a decent amount. I need 4,000 with this. Um, I'm going to use... Hang on, how many rerolls do I have? I have one more reroll. Let's go... There we go. That got me across the line. Yeah. 
Yep. <laughs> yes, sir. Just keep going with tarot cards. We need to make this stronger. Great to steal card. Nope, use this one. Holographic Joker, one and four. Nope. But that's fine, still adds a multiplier. Packs are 25% off. Let's go. Okay. Creates a random Joker card. Must have room. Interesting. Beach King held in the. Oh my god, amazing. use the king as a multiplier. Anything that adds more multiplier, definitely down for. That's a steel card, and it's a king. Okay, re-roll half of them. Okay, got a pet. Ooh, I'm struggling. Um, I may have to do this, because... Yeah. That's better? Enters one into a stone card, creates a steel card. Let's go create a steel card. Wait, why can't I pick this? What the hell? Or is there a maximum number of tarot cards you can use? Doesn't it let me... It doesn't let me use any. Have I hit the max? Hang on. Just a sec. I'm gonna read into it. Chat, give me a sec. It doesn't say... Unless no more space is available. But there's space available, that's weird. Why is it not letting me then? Oh no, there we go. 
Oh, you gotta select the card, idiot. Okay, I see. Um, I'll make a steel card out of the ice. Okay. I was being a moron. to get me across the line? I hope so. Should. Okay, uh, let's... I've got a steel card, that's good. Um... Okay, good enough. There's like three multipliers here. Because of the king. Doubles the amount of money. Just gonna buy and use it. Give me the multiplier. Old Joker cards, tarot cards. Alright, we'll do that. It's that one again, sort of a kind. I don't know what's better. The multiplier is always better than just that. That one's interesting. But I'd be risking it by getting it. Take the gamble. wasn't a mistake. I think I need to go for the face cards here. A 
confidence to go or as high as I wanted to. Okay, those are my face cards. Power of the face cards. Okay, lucky. I just realized this was play one type of hand, and you know, it just so happened that that's what I'm doing anyway. Dude, are you kidding? Level up pair? Again? Okay. Discard, I'll take that. And the tarot card thing. Convert the left card. Hang on, convert. Select two cards, convert the left card into the right card. Oh no, add hologram to a joker. I'm gambling on that. Doesn't matter. Playing into this whole thing, right? Okay. So now this is as good as the thing that was like add the multiplier when I'm out of discards. Now it's just as good. This is... this is looking good. Might actually have success this time. Money. Definitely use that. Select the left card. Convert the left card into the right card. So convert the left card into the right card. Okay, cool. Oop, I guess get that. Sure. No rank or suit. But then, so if I do, you're telling me if I do this. Okay, it still counts as a pair. It still worked. 
mental. Oh, you can reorganize. I'm an idiot, so I could have done... Okay, see, there's something. There's a strategy. Reorganize the card so then you get the correct one to trigger. That's something I haven't done before. are considered face cards. Sell this. Holy shit. It's going to re-trigger every single card now. So now it doesn't matter. <sighs> had, to go, had to go for that. Decrease the level of the played poker hand. Okay, but like, that's bad overall. This is gonna happen every turn, doesn't it? Now this doesn't matter. Now it's kind of, well, everything counts as a face card, so it, it doesn't matter. That's so annoying, man. It's going to undo everything I did leveling up the pair. I might even lose because of this shit, like... It's not even anywhere close to 40,000. That was going so well.
guess that's what's ha that's what happens when you don't diversify. That was satisfying though, like either way. Despite it, 60,000, like man. Getting past that. Okay, don't play face cards. I think I can go, I can roll with that. Oh, yeah, level up two pack. Okay, so avoid face cards altogether. So now we're doing opposite of the last round. Let me get an easy multiplier here. Discards. All oh, right, I'll still get me across the line. This is a good one to get early. If I don't discard and just play. Interesting. God. Okay. I think this this one can be worked. Both of these are good. very quickly. One in four chance to upgrade the played poker hand. What? Go negative 20 in debt. All face cards. be interesting. I'm willing to try.
plus 40 chips for each remaining discard. Since I'm not doing a discard build, that works. Bye. Cards. Get rid of that as well. What the hell? Just leveled it up again. What is happening? <laughs> Three, two, trigger two, four, or five. Um, gonna, s gonna sell this. I'm gonna use this because yeah, we're not using base cards. Oh shit, I did a discard. But it does minus one. It doesn't reset it, so that's useful. Keep forgetting. It's actually pretty decent. Yeah, okay. This is killing it. I think this is going well. Plus three malt for every Joker card. Hmm. Let's just leave it. way to discard it.
yeah, ride the bus is now just incredible. Reroll the boss blind. Yeah, boss blind, definitely. Some of the boss blinds are annoying. She's two joker cards, playing cards, alright. And break up. Dude, this is good because this build now I can do most hands as long as it doesn't involve face cards. It seems to be doing well. one joker slot. What does that mean? Add a red seal. It lets me have one more joker, but then the hand size is smaller. Cards with club suit give plus four more. Let's just go next round. Interesting. Uh, kinda got no choice but to discard, unfortunately. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. As long... We'll still score. Okay, now this is a good one. one tarot card. 
every card played counts in scoring. I don't think I want that. Oh, that'll undo what I just lost. Perfect. An extra hand. Um, choose from two random joker cards. There we go, plus eight, three plus eighteen multiplier, let's go. Build isn't as restrictive. Still hasn't leveled up the hands that many time. It was going mental with the level ups before, but not this time. Shit. Have to use a discard. Doubles money and it's just max of 20, so it's like, whatever, that's not great. I don't think converting to suits benefits me. It's just, it's not what my build is about. Okay, um. How do I re roll this? I'll re roll boss, there it is. One and seven cards get drawn face down. That's not bad. Alright, we'll do that one. Okay, so that's a king. We know this. Had to discard. Okay, double three. I love that this lets me play whatever I want. Just as long as I don't play face cards, it, it just it's very, very fluid. No, uh, let's just get rid of that. Where's my one and four to upgrade it? <laughs> A 
I think I should save my money to reroll bosses. It's never going to be as good. Okay, let's just keep going. I appreciate this trick of, like, being able to re-roll without re-rolling. Probably the most useful advice I've gotten. There we go. Pez leveled up. I hope we got strength. Select two. Okay, that's a good one. Select the left card and convert it to the right card. Pretty easy. Select king, convert it to that. There we go. Get rid of face cards. One less face card. build it's it's working the fuck random multiplier it's like wild card and a half interesting one like curiosity this could be like curiosity kills the cat I think I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna forego it not while things are good Destroys up to two cards. Interesting. Nope, we're definitely re-rolling that boss. Uh-oh. Base chips and malt are halved. Ugh.
Okay, that's, that's fine. Got rid of more face cards. I think I've, I've reached a new record now. I haven't gotten this far before. Plus one discard, yep, redeem it. That'll just get me more chips indirectly. stream today so this is today shit I'm gonna have to discard yep uh, it's hot outside so lazy day haven't really done much today In the, in the mid 30s. It hasn't calmed down. Creates two planet cards, must have room. Get a seven. Actually, get a ten. Increases the rank of up to two cards by one. No. Nah. Enhances to become bonus cards. Okay, that'll do. not gone this far ever, so I'm kind of excited.
22,000, not bad. B34, shit. Back to discard. I should have done two pair. Oh well, doesn't matter. Like, my pair is at level five. It's. It does a lot. Yeah, it's 17,000 from a pair. Okay, I'm sitting comfortably. We trigger all card held in hand abilities. Hmm. Okay, we'll go Celestials. Level up full house, level up straight flush, level up pair. Yeah, level up pair. Creates a lost tarot card so I could level up the pair again. Answers to a wild card, increases the rank. Select two cards and convert them. Stone card. I reckon just take. Yeah, so now this is at level seven or eight. I don't know. Extra large blind. No, thank you. Let's hope this goes well. Leveled up the pair. <laughs> it's now level eight. <laughs> okay, just do that again, and I got this. Um, oh, that sucks. Seven, eight, nine. I'm just gonna have to play it like this. It's like whatever. It's gonna cost me more to re-roll. Than it is to just roll with this. Yeah, that's fine. Got it. I made it to anti eight. I have never made it this far. So this is the home stretch now. I might actually win. Celestial packs always contain the planet card for your most... Oh my god. Okay. So you're telling me now it's just always going to... Yep, level up the pair. It's at level 9. Doubles the amount of money, goes to 20. Um, I reckon... This, like, money's not too important. Let's just get more cards that give more multipliers. 
Okay. 50,000. One random joker disabled every hand. Oh my god. Ugh. That sounds... That sounds horrible. Okay, so the way I'm playing this pair is my strongest hand. There's no question about it. I'm only playing pairs. It's level 10. Insane. I think I finally have success. Converts three to spade. Three trick roll. No. no. Tarot cards. Alright, open it. Destroy two cards. Up to two cards. Converts one card to a gold. Creates a joker card. Creates a stone card. Um, create a stone card. Get rid of the king. There we go. Flips and shuffles all joker cards. Ah! Ah! Oh, that's worse. Oh, I don't know if I can survive this this boss. The pair is at level eleven now. I mean, this is, what I have here is amazing. It's just, this last boss is going to mess it up. Plus one discard, banana, that's no, fine. Um, like this. I think I do all at crown. No, this is nothing like actual poker. And also that stuff doesn't interest me. Mm, I reckon I get a steel card. I know multiple people that work that crown. And, um, just the stories they would tell. You once put 20 in a slot machine and got nothing back. That's usually how it goes, yeah. Do tell. Uh, they're not stories for here, but I'd rather not. Please don't make me reroll. Okay, there we go. That'll do. I'm decreasing my multiply every time I do that. Alright, that's it. I did it. You can... I won. I won! 
And I won with Pez. Just playing two cards most of the time. It worked. But I didn't have to, I didn't have to do it that way because the build that I had, I think any way would have worked. It's just that card that upgraded the hand that you played, it uh Yeah, it did well. Okay, hang on. Times three multiply if hand has a diamond card club. Oh, that's like variety card. Win a run without playing flush. Interesting. Win a run. There we go. Copies, copies ability of the Joker to the right. Yo. Win a run with blue deck on any difficulty. Start with the telescope voucher. Negative one consumable slot. Use a total of 25 tarot cards. Okay. Oh, see, it shows. It shows. Stake base difficulty. Oh, you can't change it. New run. Oh, here we go. Oh. Small blind gives no reward money. Applies all previous stakes. I see. And then it's like a completion mark. I'm going to stick with just base difficulty for now. Once I get better, I'll do some other ones. Um, let's try yellow deck. I haven't played yellow. Gravitate to two pair. Okay, that's what I was after before. I think the ability to reroll the boss is, is important. That is a very useful voucher. Because the two bosses I changed were kind of obnoxious to deal with. So. That sucks. Does nothing, question mark? Bullshit. What does it do? <laughs> I don't believe that for a second. I bought it. I mean, that's how you learn in these games. Ace, two, three, four, five. that a card game would hook me this much. But I, I can't help it. It's so much fun. No discard. Alright, I guess do that. It's something. Crap. 
right to the last tower card. Yeah, be good. I never got lucky with that, I've only seen it happen once. Well, that's just unfortunate, isn't it? I'll still do it. Still worthwhile, I think. For this last and God, didn't do it, but. The reason I did this is I can do this. It should get me across the line because it'll get like a 15 multiplier. There we go. Retrigger the first card when scoring. Fun. I'm having fun, yeah. I won. I won a run. I tasted victory. satisfying to win. Not sure about this one. I guess we'll see. just win off this by doing discard discard on this is just gonna make sure I make it oh, damn it I wish I had that when any boost the pack skip that's a good one I don't have enough money oh well I don't think this is going to go too far because I don't really have anything that is causing me to score high. At least not yet.
I'm just blowing the discard on purpose. So then I get my multiplier. Plus two chips for every dollar you have. So if you save money... Hmm, interesting. I mean, let's try it. I'm willing to try new things. I don't believe it. cards. I'm doing this on purpose. encouraging not spending money, which I'm, I don't know. Maybe early on it's fine, but later I will want to get rid of it. Nope. Nope. Minus one ante, minus one hand per round. What the fuck? I can't sell vouchers though. I don't know what the blank voucher does. It has to do something. I don't believe it does nothing. I have to play off discards here. I, I don't think I can do anything else. As annoying as this is, like this is this is the way. Face cards give 30 when scored. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna have to go for things that give me something. Create two common jokers if I skip this. Nah. Okay, so what are we doing? Okay. 
such a risky way I'm playing, but I got no option. have to find my way to score. <laughs> this is the only way to score currently. Mm. Yeah, look, I mean, that's cheap and it gets the job done. Extra large blind. Bet. Okay. This is concerning. Triple seven. I right, get rid of the nine eight. Get rid of the eight. All right, zero discards. Did a good job. Another full house. This one's not going to go as hard, I don't think. Yeah, still. Okay, now it's just whatever. I'm not doing too badly, actually. For $3, I'll take it. It worked. Reroll the boss ante. I think I'm gonna have to. Even that's going to reduce the power of the other thing. This is just too good. Okay, next. This play style, man. <laughs> it's so frightening. the pack skipped. Uh, without an... I can do this. I'm gonna make a powerful multiplier.
<laughs> this is scary. Play five cards. All right, got it. That sucks. Okay, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That can be nice. All right, I'm just gonna. Just has to be a dick about this, doesn't it? Okay, cool. I mean... Give me a high score. You have to play five cards, so... This one won't go as hard. Still enough. Okay. I need to get a joker that multiplies, well, adds more coins. Like right now, base cards are my way to score. Anytime there's a face card in the combo, it does well. Go next round. Don't really have any reason.
I've been pretty comfortable with it, but I just, I just uh, I'm worried about it. to that. Okay, diamond cards are rebuffed. A debuffed. Alright, well, this is gonna be... Okay. Multiply that's the problem is that I'm relying on face cards and nothing else. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of these. That sucks. I imagine high card is just gonna work. I wonder if you can win just by playing one card at a time. That'd be interesting. That's probably a way to do it. That one seems too annoying. Blind is selected, destroy the Joker to the right, and permanently add double its cell value to multiplier. That would be kind of a sick one to do early on, but no. Spectral cards, tarot. Alright, let's do spectral.
Destroys one random card in your hand and adds two enhanced aces to your hand. Seems fine. Okay. <laughs> the confidence in this run is like lowering. Lowering by the minute. I mean, it's surviving, it's just, it, it can't survive. Ultimately, the scores are just going to get too high for me to keep up with. Really, just one shot. enough. I think this one's not doing much, like, re-triggering. Uh, I guess it sort of. Nothing useful. I'm gonna lose. Played face cards have a multiplier. Plus four multiplier when scored. I guess if I'm playing with face cards, let's go into the face card build. Play only one hand. Fuck me. <laughs> Alright. Um... We need to get as many face cards as possible in, in this. So a full house with face cards would be the best hand I could do here. Now the question is, does it score 20,000? It does. <laughs> I survived. How the fuck am I- how am I surviving this, honestly? This is a good one to get. Just keep buying the packs and... Encourages it. <laughs> good job. 
I'm barely hanging in there. I can't, I can't see this going beyond this round here. I'm too reliant on playing off the face cards, and if I don't, then I lose. Three, four, five, six. This is not going to get much of a score. I mean, really? I need to score 10,000 in this or I lose. If this doesn't get me 10,000, I lose. Got me 10,000. Trigger all cards play for them now. Let's see if maybe this gives me something. Gives it I can get money and get eight. Enhances two multi cards, creates a random Joker card, must have a room. Okay. okay. Alright, so. Good. Okay, become multi cards, will you? Then just go. I kind of messed up with that seal card. I shouldn't have put it on a face card. See, it's kind of... I go off with one big attack, and then I kind of fall off. The rest of my moves just suffer. That's the problem with what I'm doing right now. There's no plan B. It stagnates unbelievably. I'm surprised I've made it this far. Okay, well this next hand has to generate... It has to generate a lot of points. It might, we'll see. I doubt it. has to generate at least 15,000. 
8,000. No one here. Yeah. I mean, I got pretty far. Try again with this. This is fine. Not sure how I feel about st starting with more money. I still don't know how it works. I mean, this is poker. It's just math, alright? Like, look look here. When I click a card, see? The card's worth 10. And then here it tells me what it's going to score. So that would be 10 times 2. That would be 10 times 3. That would be 40 times 4. So then when I play it, it'll plus 10, plus 10, plus 10, plus 8, plus 8. So it becomes 86 times 4. And that's how much I get. about making the highest numbers you can. Retrigger the first card. Plus one card slot available in shop. I mean, this is a good one early on, so let's just... Let's just go. I think I just need to not do what I did last time. Face cards again. Go with the Lucky King. So now let's take this example of this top card, right? So let's say I play this card. So it'd be 5 times 1, then you add 10, it'd be 15 times 1. But then this thing says, hey, trigger the card again. So it'd be plus 10, plus 10, which would make it 25 times 1. So all, all this thing says is the first card that plays, whatever it says here, apply it again. Do six plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus thirty times four. Plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two times four. This one's probably just worth playing. So it'd be seven. This would be seventy times three. This would get me two ten. I don't. I don't do the math normally, but uh, hopefully, kind of gives a better idea of what's going on. Let's pretty much watch this box here. On the left. 15 multiplier. Yeah, this is a good card. I might get both of these. Let's just do this. Planet cards. Planet could get a planet card as well. I'm taking advantage of the fact that I have more money. Up a straight, up a high card, up a full house. Up straight. I mean, I don't... Sometimes the math escapes me, but at least the foundation is there. So this will add plus 15 to the multiplier, but then... It has a 1 in 4 chance of being destroyed at the end of the round. Okay, I'll use a straight, because this is a level 2. And this kind of negates the the fact that six isn't counted. There you go. This this encourages not discarding and winning on your first hand. 
plus 50 chips if there's a pair, plus 100 chips if there's a straight. Go with straights. Let's see if we can do this. Create two copies of one select. Are you kidding? Create two copies of one selected card in your hand. Oh, okay. I just copied the Lucky King. Well then. There's the Lucky King. I'll go full house. If I can get a face card build, that would be good. Ironically, like it wasn't good last time. Banana's still alive. Open. Plus 11 chips in the multiplier. Retrigger. Do this one. Multiplier cards are good. Okay. It's a good one. Right now, ah, oh, the banana card died. Damn. The more cards I get, the better. So I need to keep buying cards. One free reroll per shot. Now do this. Level up pair, level up four of a kind, level up high card, level up pair. Okay, next. Play only one hand type this round. Okay, so I think for this, I'm gonna play pairs because I've got three pairs here. And hopefully this will get me across the line. Unfortunately, the banana being gone is bad. Ugh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be close. Okay, so let me... There's the king. Lucky king. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to... Yeah, go. I got plus 20 from it. Okay, do this again. Play the lucky king again. It should get me over the line. I got a 20 multiplier. Alright. And I got $20 for free, because it was a 1 in 15 chance it was going to give me 20 bucks, so... Money! Let's just do this. Okay, that's all we want. Don't use... 
Okay, hang on. Uncommon Joker's given it. The first face card... The first played face card gives up two multiplayer. Don't play face cards, but we have the Lucky King, so I think do this. I should have bought this one first. So I'll sell this. Then sell. I don't know what tag means. I kind of went into that. Another king. Yeah, I mean, look. Go for our lucky kings. Three, four, five, six, seven. What does this mean? I think I need an explanation for tags. What are tags? Sorry, I'm tapping out. Balatro tag. Tags are benefits you receive for skipping a blind, depending on the type of tag. Oh. So skipping is beneficial. Okay, got it. card held in hand has a chance no enhances into a wild card doubles the amount of money destroys two cards enhances things into a wild card um make this a wild card definitely doesn't get rid of the luck Damn it, it did. Okay, well that's alright. I have two copies of that card. Alright, now I know. Reroll start for zero. messed up with the king. if like hair is good what happens let's see this is curiosity not really that great get me over the line. Wait, not allowed. Oh, no repeat hand type. Shit. Uh-oh. Um, high card. Should work.
Yeah, just. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Prevents death if chips scored are at least 25% of the required chips. And then adds a multiplier anyway, sure. It's 5 a.m. and going to sleep. Yeah, go to sleep. <laughs> but thanks for hanging out. Yeah, I don't know, man. This one. If we don't discard, it's a good one. One stone card. When a blind is selected. I don't know if we want that. It seems risky. Good night, Vanna. Okay, this is a bit better. Just don't discard. Alright, this is going a little better. Playing face cards. Gave me straight up money. Ten of four. This is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Face cards, hand sides. All right, let's just go next round.
Damn. <laughs> one with one move. That joke was kind of eh. When a blind is selected, gain three hands but lose all discards. That's a good synergy for the one that um, works around not using discards. Shit. I guess I have money, so that's fine. Okay. Uh, what can I do here? This is. These are bad cards. I have to discard. That's a bit better. Bunch of money. Okay, just play the pair. Don't need to go any further. Just, like, just lose two dollars. Still okay for money. Could have gone worse. straight five times, okay. Interesting. Is this one of these builds where I can win off pair? I guess, let's see. Trigger this card. I mean, steel cards are usually good. Multi card and foil. Lucky card. Yeah, yeah, multi card foil. Okay. 
Okay, steel card in play. does seem to be getting stronger each time, so can't go wrong. Straight haven't been used. Full house has been used a couple of times. Okay. Diversifying. Face cards. Increase a malt. Nah. Fine. Starts with zero discards. Okay, that's fine. Oh, it's going to cancel out that one. Kind of blows, but okay. Okay. That's going to become a gold card. I need more. Okay, well, I guess it's all in with this. No, I don't think it's gonna work. This will trigger. Cause it let me survive that card. Okay, now I need a new card. What is this card? I don't know what this is going to do. Add a purple seal. Add polychrome. Destroy all other jokers. No, thank you. Destroy one random card in your hand. No. 
not. All right, we'll do this. Whoa. That, uh, that worked out. I'm worried about this card, but I guess we'll see what happens, huh? Doubles the amount of money, planet cards, double the amount of money. That'll make up a little bit. Oh boy, I can't wait to see what this does. Seems like it's just a random multiplier. That's interesting. I mean, I'm all for this. Roll up path, short. card, straight, do pair, level up straight, we'll use straight. The first hand is drawn face down, it sucks. That's rather obnoxious. I guess I'm going for face cards because they're the ones that have lucky values on them. It's not that I'm that interested in them. tarot cards. Alright, let's do that. Steel card converts three into spades. Sell that. Let's get a refund. Gold seal. Converts all cards in hand to a single random rank. Beneficial. Okay. So sevens, it's going to be easy to get. I mean, let's just play five random cards. How lucky? Okay. 
Okay. that Want to hand side, I, I just undid what happened. So I just removed the negative effect of what I just did. Spectral cards are interesting. Destroy. Okay. Yeah. Jack, um, multi cards. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Jack. Okay. Didn't go off. get rid of the glass cards by making them steel cards. and we don't have glass cards. It's an interesting build. Two tarot cards. Let's see. Increases the rank of two cards by one. Oh my god, I got it. 
beautiful thing. Actually, I should have kept the seven. Seven has more chance of getting a pair. It's all right, it worked out, I guess. Yes, got the 20 multiplier. cards give 30 chips when scored. This might be like a really... I can't believe it worked again. Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's for a kind high card. Sure. If I get a boss that levels down the hand, that's gonna suck. Get okay, spade cards, thankfully. Okay, let's get rid of you. I'm gonna redraw everything. But it's a wild card. It can be played as any suit. I mean, let's just do this. Get rid of it. How does that work? I guess it still gets debuffed, even though it's whatever. Okay, GG steel card. No, that'll make a triple. First instinct was correct. Huge. It only adds 50 chips, though. It's not really a lot when you think about it. One random joker disabled every hand. Ugh, that's gonna suck, but okay. I'm honestly not sure how this is going to go. Just have to do my best, huh? The 
The one that's gonna hurt is Supernova. If that gets disabled, that sucks. Okay, well that's just free money. That's a pretty beneficial card. I'll add another seven. Gold doesn't matter. It still got me a lot of points. Like straight is also good. Enhances two cards to bonus cards. Enhances one card to a light card. Convert the left card into the right card. Convert the left card into the right card. I'd much rather on a lucky king. Well, wish me luck. Okay, that one's not too bad. doesn't trigger again. Okay, wait. No, do it. Do it anyway. Ooh, it's gonna be close. the worst one to get disabled in the last round. I'm not going to make it. I've lost. It's going to be 
very unlikely that I get 40k off this one hand. Yeah. Sucks, man. <laughs> Alright. I'll do one more run. I thought that one was going to win, but just the disabling of the Joker, I knew as soon as that was on there that that was going to cause problems. It was a good build otherwise. Two pair again. Two pairs, that's how we're playing. The strike is fine. This just does something. I thought that I might have a chance of doing something bad, but I didn't see anything bad happen as a result of having it. Spade, yeah, it's more or less the same thing. Early, early two pair. Must play five cards. Okay, well that's fine. Doesn't really alter what I'm doing. Can probably win in one hand. This card is useful. If we use a flush, converts this cards to diamond. Alright, good planet again. Let's, I'm gonna play around the concept of four. Doesn't matter what I what I use. This joker will carry for a little bit. Base cards give value, sure. Well, 
Let's just make the base cards a little stronger. Let's look, two cards. Yeah. I always gotta go with that one. That one's like beneficial if it works. Retrigger all played cards in the final hand of the round. I'm buying both of these. I'm getting my jokers now. Retrigger all card in hell held in hand abilities. That's like steel cards that were re triggers, which, eh. This one's good. Okay. Kind of unfortunate. And now. That raised fist did it. Try and get the extra hand one. Full house. thinking. Face cards and then when I don't have face cards it's all, it still does well. three. Or double, so it's six.
go with full house. I've used full house a few times. Shit, I hate this one. Did it just really give me practically the same cards again? Okay. That's cool, I guess. Zero. I mean, Odd Todd is good. I'm going to try and remove my reliance on it. Relying on face cards, it could get dangerous. Hold on. I think what I should do here is do this. Two cards, odd cards. Um, yeah, that one. Okay. 
shit. So I know what they are now. There's gotta be... I mean, re-rolling's not gonna help here. This one's kind of annoying to deal with. What are the odds? I think it's just playing the five cards that I know, honestly. I'm just hope for the best. Okay, no. So now what I'm gonna do... Ow! That fixes it. Find a selector, the joker to the right is destroyed and then adds double its cell value to malt. But that would mean just keep buying jokers. I think it's worth doing it. Card to the right. Okay. So save money for jokers. So now this is interesting because face cards don't do shit. I figured that was worth doing because then at least the multiplier is high to begin with. Trying to like level up everything equally. I 
which, yeah, I mean, sort of. As long as I keep buying jokers, it's fine. Okay, so now it's at 10. Yeah, this is not bad, this one. Nearly. Oh, okay. Another full house. that that was a 23 multiplier, otherwise that would not have worked. Um, since this is going to win anyway, I'm not, I'm going to opt to not neglect the pair. Oh no, it didn't win. I thought it was going to win. Okay, now, it'll, dude, 25 points, there's no way. That would have been embarrassing if that was the last hand, but it wasn't. Just a strategy, just making sure that all the hands are kind of equal. So they gain a multiplier no matter what. I hate this one. But okay. Not a whole lot I can do about that. This is here. Okay. Not looking good. I don't want to level down this. But I feel like I kind of have to play it, just because my multiplier is not high. Yeah, there we go. It sucks that I have to do this, but I have no choice.
that only really got that much. Okay, I think I, I know what I need to do. It's gotta be with odd numbers. There we go. Yeah, that's better. <sighs> I'll get across the line with it. like to get that one. That one's good early on. Because you can build it up over time. Jack. Trying not to default to two pair constantly. Discards left. Okay, we'll go with the old reliable. the cheaper joker it's going anyway. Okay. 
Bungie, I guess the more expensive Jericho would sell for more, wouldn't it? Okay, I think I know how to play. But this is just... Aim for odd cards where possible. The face cards are kind of worthless, so I need to get away from them. good. cards in this again flush for the win I think the distribution of hands that I've used is good as well. Like, two pair is the good one, but everything else is kind of okay. So I'm not pigeonholed as much. I do need to get away from... Well, I guess I can't, because I'm not really modifying my deck. I keep increasing the multiplier of this one. I don't really have an option. I just have to. Lose one dollar. Oh, that's nothing. It's like, okay, whatever. Like, it's gonna have minimal effect on me. Okay, get rid of the king. Yes. Oh, right, you can go into the negatives. I forgot about that. Yeah, but like, whatever. What am I gonna do? It's, it's a $40,000 blind. Like, I'm gonna have to. Which means I can't buy any more jokers, like this is probably it. I know I threw away a pair, but playing around the strategy of at this point whatever <laughs> I've... it's my fate I'm gonna lose money here Two pair, but it has to score well. Okay, either way, jacks. Ends. That sucks. All right, well, just do that.
Okay. Um, let's go with this. <laughs> I'm not going to earn money now. I'm still alive. But it looks like this is not going to get any stronger. Okay. I mean, I want to be balanced, you know? Not rely on one hand type. Also, I think technically full house is a little better. But I have two pair to fall back on. Yeah, full house is 10, two pair is 24. Okay. I don't think, like, this is such a deficit, it's so annoying. Good full house. God. Uh, what am I gonna do? I guess that's something. It's not great, but it's something. I'm worried. I 
Okay, that may have saved my butt. hand. All I have is this. From what I can see. Six, seven, eight, nine. Not enough. Yeah, I think I'm gonna bust. There's no... This is not gonna score well because it's not gonna trigger that. Thing before I give up. I don't think there's anything else I can do. I think at this point even high card would like score more than than this. Like yes it's five times one but then that'll add 30. It'll be 35. <laughs> Time, well I guess it's times three, maybe not. It's all I have. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. There's a ten missing. That would have done it. Alright. Yeah, pitiful. Alright. What do I got? <laughs> Tell jokers. I don't think I sold them, they kind of got destroyed, but sure. Permanently earned another hand per round. Per round? That's gotta be expensive. Alright, well, that'll do it for Baltro. I've played enough. <laughs> Again, a lot. Um, yeah, a lot was done. At least I won. So I've won once. I'm happy with that. Uh, so yeah, if you're watching this later on YouTube as a replay, thanks for sticking around till the end, and hope you have enjoyed these streams of Balatro. If you have and want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just do things like click the like button, subscribe, or you can also watch me play other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. Uh, that stuff does help out a lot, so thank you to those that do that. But uh, there'll be more of this soon, at some point, I'm sure. 